Oh, I see a fish chasing you, actually. What the? Oh, my gosh. I'll tell you what, guys. <laughs> Dustin's been having fun today. You didn't know he used to be like Hank Aaron. He's from Indiana, and he, he knows how to swing for the fences. But he's been got, getting a lot of fish. One thing we're learning about this place is this is our first time ever to White Top Laurel. There's an endless amount of places to fish here. You know, kudos for the state of Virginia for stocking what we read to be a seven mile stretch of water. You know, they, I guess, go up and down this stream with the truck, stock it along the way. We've now fished about maybe a mile section and we found some really, really nice holes. Matter of fact, more nice holes than we could fish. Beast! Ooh, big rainbow. Big rainbow. Beast boy. Get back here. We're gonna let you go, Mr. Bo. We're gonna let you Ooh. go, Mr. Bo. That's right. These are, these are hard fighting fish. Yeah, big head shakes, man. Cold, clear water. They like the battle. If fishing these ultralight rods just make it make it that much more enjoyable. Well, look where you hooked them to, right hook. in the snout. Right there. That's a good hook. That is a good hook. Mm. Look at that. I just made the switch, you know. I, I'm a gold label guy. Uh, no, no hidden secret there. The uh, it got me believing here in Virginia on the orange deluxe. I've been killing the fish on those. I made the switch up in the hole earlier. I started with the orange deluxe. Uh, didn't have a gold label, switched to silver label, bobber down. I uh, came down there, a couple drifts with silver label, nothing happening, put the orange deluxe on. Guess what, folks? Bobber down, fish on. Right there, the proof is in the net. We are in them now. I got a wild fish, of course. It is a wild fish. Oh, take me down, take me down. Oh, won't you please take me home? Hey everybody, so check this out, man. This, this is an awesome hole right here. We got big structure in the water. It's deep and you can see it's kind of kind of tethered up, different rock layers. And these fish are laying in the bottom of these holes. So I'm actually running a little bit deeper with my slip float, running these size eight fire hooks. I'm one for four in this hole and I'm seeing fish starting around after after these eggs. What I'm using actually is these orange deluxe. You know me as a gold label guy. I love gold, but with the way the gold prices are going right now, I'm fishing the orange deluxe, and these fish are loving it. There he is. He's on again. Uh, that's, that's a bigger one, I that's think. That's a bigger one, it is. And look at that. Guess what I just, guess what I just re, rebated with? Orange deluxe, baby. Oh, he's back. Just, hey. We're going to tell them the other part of the funny story here in a second. Got him. So listen, Dustin just drifted that area. There was another angler right below us that just walked up and left. And he goes, that wasn't a fish. That was a rock. Next drift, bam, got him. Look at that fish right in the side. First drift right through this hole right here. Nailed him. Welcome to the jungle. Yeah, pretty good, He's nice. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, got Ooh, got him. a baby, Southwest Virginia sun. Look at that. <laughs> Back on, baby. I'm one for four, one for four in this hole right here. Pretty good fish. Boom. Oh, Somebody just kicked a stick right in the water. Right where I was trying to beach him. Big win for the Orange Deluxe again, my friend. Check it out. Well, if you're in the laurels, you're in the laurels on White Top Laurel. I, I beat half the national forest down trying to get through here. Yep. 
believe it or not, it's got all, this trout had all this creek to be laying in, and it was right there in that little itty bitty pocket right on the bank. Ooh, that's a nice fish. So you gotta be persistent. And fish every pocket. You bring it right to your hand. Easy one to release. Hi guys, we're out here fishing on white top oral. It's one of my home streams, one I grew up fishing also. Uh, this is how I'm catching my fish today. Peach garlic fire bait. I've just been taking very, very little out of the jar. Roll it into like a small itty bitty salmon egg and stick it right through your hook. Just like that. Oh, it's a big rainbow. How are you gonna get around this tree? I'm gonna try some Tumlin Creek. Mm. Magic here. Here we go. You're not gonna do it? I'm gonna figure something out. Here, your boy's here for the assist. Your boy's here for the assist, Fluff. All right. Put it around them. Come get it, come get it, he's got it. Come get it, come get it. Here we go, Fluff, here we go. You might have a double assist. They call me cliffhanger. <laughs> you ready, Dustin? Bang him up. Got him! Hey, look, look at that. <laughs> look, he's pink on his bottom. Too. Yeah, look at that. Hey guys, look here what a beautiful rainbow I just caught out of white top laurel. Right next to the big rock with the National Forest sign. Another beautiful, beautiful fish. You a metal flop. Boy, look at that. You know, after years of filming in Southwest Virginia, we finally got a chance to fish white top laurel and we weren't disappointed. As a matter of fact, I don't think anybody could be disappointed with fishing a stream like this, other than the fact that you have to get there within oh, a week of a stock to be able to be successful, simply because there is so many people there that they catch them pretty quick. Now this is super clear water, it's clean water, right near the town of Damascus. Now, all the stocking seems to take place, at least in this section, off Highway 58. The 58 provides you incredible access, um, you know, first along some land that's not in the forest, and then as you go up a little bit further, it is in the forest. Now, this area is stocked over seven miles. There isn't another section above this. This is a catch and release uh, regulation, you know, no bait section that we did not fish. Uh, however, our action today came in this one section, we only fished about a mile stretch right near some bridges and some obvious roadside pull-offs where we were able to find some phenomenal sized rainbow trout. Now all of our action came today. Fluff did his usual peach garlic fire bait and did very, very well. Now Dustin focused on two eggs. He switched back and forth between Silver Label and Orange Deluxe and had a fantastic day as well. One thing you'll notice is all the fish we caught here we're nice. I'm talking 14, 16, 18 inches. We didn't catch any dinks at all, uh, which tells me that they stock some beautiful rainbows during this time of year. We're also told they do some brook trout stocking here and some browns from time to time show up as well. However, today, all we caught were rainbows and we were proud to do so. Now you'll notice that the water here is super clear. That's why we tell you, make sure to use two or four pound tests. You go higher, you're gonna minimize the number of bites that you get. Also, work on focusing on smaller hooks. The guys used a size 10 fire hook today and the new fire floats, which most of you have never seen before. Um, but we had a great time in a beautiful area of Southwest Virginia that shouldn't be overlooked by any angler. Potsky products are available at sporting goods stores near you. If you can't find the specific color, size that you want, make sure to go to potsky.com. And as a thank you for watching Potsky Outdoors, we're going to show you a coupon code to be used for 10% off your next order.